title, Jake Paul boldly promises lights out for Nate Diaz. Nap time, no doubt. TLDR, our internet bad boy, Jake Paul, pledges a knockout victory in his forthcoming fight against Nate Diaz, unabashedly declaring 100%, he's going to sleep. After tasting the sting of defeat for the first time, Paul is more fired up than ever. However, will Diaz be the one to validate Paul's newfound confidence, or will he be the second serving of humble pie? Folks, it's game time. Jake Paul, our favorite problem child, is stepping back into the ring, this time locking gloves with Nate Diaz in a much-anticipated showdown in Dallas, set for August 5th. Now, Jake has never been one to shy away from a bold claim or two, but this time he's turned the volume up to 11. He's promising Diaz a one-way trip to dreamland. But hang on a minute, wasn't it just a little while ago when we saw Jake tasting the canvas courtesy of Tommy Fury? That's right, the first blemish on his previously pristine boxing record. Did this dent in his invincibility spark a newfound fervor in the YouTube sensation turned pugilist, or is it a desperate attempt to reclaim his dwindling self-assurance? Jake is playing up the drama big time, selling us all on his refreshed and refocused outlook on the sweet science. But it's not just about claiming a win here, it's about proving a point, about demonstrating that he is a different, more formidable beast after his recent defeat. What we're left wondering is, how will Diaz react to all this braggadocio? Will he be the fuel to Jake's fiery assertions or the water to douse them? Only time will tell. Boxing is a game of skill, stamina, and strategy. One might question whether our problem child has bitten off more than he can chew this time. Diaz isn't some rookie, he's a seasoned warrior, who's made a career out of proving doubters wrong. But can he withstand the self-proclaimed invigorated Jake Paul? So, where do you stand in this explosive mix of boxing bravado and sporting spectacle? Will Jake's predictions of Diaz's slumber party prove prophetic, or will we see Diaz turn the tables and, dare we say, put the problem child to bed? And now, we drop the question of the hour, the one that might keep you up tonight, does a single defeat truly kindle the fire within a fighter to come back stronger, or is it just a convenient narrative that the defeated spin to maintain their image? Let's get this conversation started.